I'm Dr. Aditi Singhvi. I'm a heart failure and transplant cardiologist at Narayana Institute of Cardiac Sciences, Bangalore. And I wanted to discuss a very important topic that is of cardiomyopathies. So cardiomyopathies is a group of disorders in which the heart muscle either becomes weak or stiff or it can become electrically abnormal. And this can cause various issues. So if the heart muscle is too weak or too stiff, it can lead to what is called heart failure, which is when you can have breathing difficulty, tiredness, swelling in your legs or feet. And this really affects people's lives. They get hospitalized again and again. And this also shortens your life expectancy. The other types of cardiomyopathies are arrhythmogenic cardiomyopathy, which is an electrical problem in the heart muscle. And this can cause life threatening heart rhythms. There are a variety of causes of cardiomyopathies. They can be inherited like genetic cardiomyopathies or they can be acquired cardiomyopathies that can happen because of an infection or because of exposure to any toxins or certain drugs like chemotherapy agents. So evaluating people for any genetic cause of cardiomyopathy is very important. And nowadays we have this kind of genetic testing that is available. Even if there is some other cause for the cardiomyopathy, there can be genetic predisposition. And finding out if there is a genetic cause for your cardiomyopathy can be very helpful. It can change your own course of management and it can also have profound implications for your family members. Your brothers and sisters can be tested, your children can be tested. And if you're planning to go ahead for family planning, then there is more ways in which it can be tested in the embryo also to make sure that you have a healthy child. So I would strongly urge everyone with cardiomyopathy, especially if you have a strong family history of cardiomyopathy, to undergo genetic testing for the same. Thank you very much.